YouTube, Vintage Yu-Gi-Oh! here today, and we have a 450 card on the dot PSA submission going out. So this is gonna be my send-off video. So I'm gonna try to go through these cards as fast as possible uh, while still covering all of them. Um, a lot of big name hitters and uh, a lot of really nostalgic old cards. So we're gonna get right into it here. So if I guess first of all, if you ever already off to a mess, if you wonder what 200 or 450 cards looks like all piled up in card saver ones, then now you know. So we're gonna cut it off right there. So PSA likes you to do this. So this is like the ending of my submission number, and then like we have line one card one, line one, card two. And it supposedly speeds up the process, so we will we'll see. I did it last time and it still didn't help, so I might write him a note and say, hey, I actually followed your rules, grade my cards faster, but we'll see. So this first, these first few cards are gonna be on the 20 day turnaround. So, and some of these are for a, a friend, so not all of these are mine, and I'll, I'll tell you when it does cut over to mine. So. We have two Dark Magicians, girls, a Monster Reborn, a uh, Faded Variety Dark Magician, Wavy, a Faded Wavy Red Eyes, just uh, a regular Red Eyes, and then here it, you show, I mean, that's just crazy, the, the printing difference between these two Exodias. This is the first Wavy Variety, but this is just absolutely bonkers, so really wish uh, I could say I own this, but I don't, and uh, really hoping this guy gets some good grades on some of these old crazy cards. Have a Trihorned, and this one's really faded as well. Right Arm of the Forbidden One. Then we have three Blue Eyes. Two, these last two are the Waver Variety. And then we get into my cards I'm sending in on a higher, faster level. We have Jinzo, a Dark Magician Girl, Two DDS Blue Eyes White Dragons. Um, this card's got a white nick, but I figure it might get an eight, so I think it might be worth to get graded. And then we have uh, Wavy Blue Eyes. If I could get one card in this submission, that would be it in 10. We have a Glossy and Wavy Dark Magician. We got a Sean and Jump Championship Dark End Dragon. Really excited to own this. And got the big boy Stardust Dragon. And the last Yu-Gi-Oh card that I'm submitting at a fast rate is Chaos Emperor Dragon. And you guys have seen all these Pokemon cards before, so I'm not gonna really go through them too fast, but really, really neat uh, to kind of get in on Pokemon a little bit. So, Gengar, Shining Charizard, Shining Noctowl, Shining Steelix. So then that is the f all of the fast rates. So this is the beginning of the uh, 85 business day turnaround. So different submission, line one, uh, item one. So start off with, and these first few with the, the tabs are not mine. Triumph Dragon, Faded versus uh, Second Print. Another really good example of these really faded cards. Got two right legs, a left leg, and then I believe we have three or four left arms. Yeah, four left arms. Flame Swordsman times two, a dark hole. Really faded man-eater bug. Glossy trap hole, faded trap hole, Swords of Revealing Light, Soul and Judgment, Seven Tools Bandit, Horn of Heaven, Mirror Force, all first edition where possible. Okay. Continue with the MRD. We got Time Wizard, Change of Heart, Thousand Dragon, Twin Edit Thunder, Heavy Storm, Tribute to the Doom, Karibo, some Gate Guardian pieces, two Garnesias. He's got Three K or uh, Black Luster Soldier, Envoy of the Ends. He's submitting and one Chaos Emperor Dragon. So really, hope he can get some good grades on these cards. 
Dark Paladin. I really, I never remember how to pronounce this card. Help, Helpmer, Lava Golem, two Harpies from Forbidden Memories, a Red Eyes, Black Metal, End of Anubis, and just an Unlimited Red Eyes and a Nimble Manga. So that is the end of his card. So from everything beyond that point, all of these cards here that you see are mine. So I believe the last opening on the channel um, is me opening these tournament one packs. So really excited to have pulled this Axe Raider. If you haven't uh, seen the video, check it out and see the other goodies I pulled. You have Patrol Robo, El Slight, Steel Shell, Burning Spear, Gust Fan, Beast King of the Swamps, Versaggio, the Destroyer, Ramii, Gust Fan, Tiger Axe, Giant Flea, Hercules Beetle, another Hercules Beetle, some more TP1 commons. All these commons will be for sale. And some TP2 cards, Queen of Autumn Leaves, really a if I, if I hit those TP1 uh, rares, I will pretty much have completed the set except for White Hole and um, uh, I really need the, the Axe Raider to get a 10 as well. Some TP6, Toon Cannon Soldier, actually, I, and then I have the four supers that come with it. And then we have a TP7, Breaker the Magic Warrior, really good looking card. And a TP8, Magical Arm Shield times two and Dunam Stark Witch times two. This is the blue eyes I pulled from uh, one of my 10 videos back on the channel. So if you guys remember that, this is that car. So hopefully it can do, do well. And then a reprinted guy, the Dragon Champion, an unlimited tune world that I pulled from one of the tins. And then I'm submitting some common MRD cards. I'm trying to complete LOB and Gym at 10 the whole set, but I don't think I'm gonna get crazy enough to try to complete MRD with 144 cards, but never know. Just these are some of the, the cooler looking artworks in my opinion, so. Winged Dragon Guardian, the Fortress, Larva Moth, couple Harpy Ladies, um, Mystic Lamp, like Google, Uguchi, Kaminari Attack, Rainbow Flower, Swamp Battle Guard, Sag Soggy the Dark Clown, Dragon Piper, a couple of pumpkins, a couple of ancient brains, lava battleground, skull guardian, unhappy medium, ring of magnetism, and stem pack. So that's all the MRD commons I'm sending. And then we'll get into a few rares and then some holographic cards. Great Moth, Cannon Soldier, and then Senga the Thunder, the Kazajin, Karibo, Change of Heart. And then a couple Magic Ruler cards, Toon Summon Skull, and Blue Eyes Toon Dragon. Then I'm sending a few Pharaoh Servant cards, um, Commons that is, Harpy Brother times two, Sword Hunter times two, and a Morphing Jar number two. Okay. Then we have a few Pharaoh Servant Hollows, Parasite, Parasite, Mirror Wall, Call of Haunted, Cease Fire. Really would like these two to get tens. I do not have tens in these two. Uh, Buster Blader, Fiend Mega Cyber, Beast of Talwar. And then a couple of Legacy of Darkness cards Hin Hino Kagusuchi, Twin Head Behemoth, and Luster Dragon. Would be really neat to get uh, 10 out of one of these three at least. A random Liberth of Nightmare Mask Beast. Really love the artwork on this. I own one. And I bought one for a binder card and it ended up looking gradable. So this is gonna get submitted. Luster Dragon, Breaker of the Magic Warrior from Mag Magician's Force, uh, uh, alternate art Dark Paladin, and a card I would really like to get a 10 as well is this Diffusion Wave Motion. Then we have another, uh, should have probably put that with the Mass Beast, but I've, I've typed all these into PSA already. so. This is the order of submission, you know, line 118, item one. So, too late for that. Cyber Jar and Pot of Greed. Then we have Majestic Star Dragon. See if I can get it to pop. There we go, kind of. We have two of those, so really hoping one of those can get a 10. And uh, 
one of the last few videos on this channel uh, that I did a box opening, a special edition box opening, Crimson Crisis, and I was lucky enough to pull this. So excited to get that graded. Then we have some just random promos, Master Collection 1, Dual Master Guide, 2002 10 series, Reverse Foil, uh, open that on the channel, XYZ Dragon, and then we have the Duelist of Roses, uh, video game promos, it's wearing my arm out. Forbidden Memories promo and Game Boy International Secret Rare promos and the uh, Power of Chaos Yugi five card promo set and a random negate attack. A couple unlimited uh, Master of Oz and then uh, these are first edition, I guess. Defense Tactics and Hero Hero Sphinx Ultra Rare. Uh, Dark Bright and a card, another Ghost Rare that I'd really like to get a 10 would be this Rainbow Dragon. We have a couple Absolute Power Force, uh, Gatlin Dragon from Flames of Eternity, fuses two of my favorite machines, the other Barrel Dragon and Blowback, so really uh, hoping that can do well. Fossil Dyna, and then three cards from Legendary Duelist Pegasus, just Really cool ancient Egypt, uh, you know, the Millennium Eye and then Barrel Dragon. So, can't go wrong with Barrel Dragon in my opinion. Whew. So, I'm gonna pause the video here real fast and uh, we'll just keep going. I'll just rearrange real fast here. Make some room. Okay, so I'm gonna try to go through these really fast because it's just, this is all LLB, I think from here on out, except for a few more Pokemon cards at the end. And I have duplicates of about everything. So this is, these are literally every common that I do not own. And I'm trying to send at least two copies. So I have a trial hell already, so I'm just sending one. And we'll be selling off all the duplicates for um, really cheap. So, this is, uh, I mean, I only own like uh, 10, 10 or so uh, LOBs in Gym Mint 10 that aren't hollows currently. So this is really ambitious for me to try to, uh, to try to complete this in one submission. I'm sure I'll be like one or two short and then it'll just bug me. But yeah, just every, LOB common. I don't own a legendary sword and I'm only sending one, so that's one I'm kind of dependent on. Sending three beast fangs, only one violet crystal, and book of secret arts. These short prints are hard to find, so the, I'm sending cards that I are only 10 candidates in my eyes, so not just sending cards to send cards. But I'm sure some random card in here will just get like a six or something stupid. Like, whatever. Okay, so we're down to the last stack, approaching 14 minutes, so not doing terribly too bad. Remove Trap, Beaver Warrior, Witty Phantom. So, just really, a lot of these are pretty worthless um, cards. It's just a, more of a, a personal challenge and uh, the artwork on these are all really, uh, really well um, put together in my opinion. So I do love the artwork on a lot of these cards. Dark Energy is a hard one to find, sending two of those, sending two laser cannon armors. This Dragon tre Treasure has this whitening up here, so I know I'm gonna be chasing that one in 10, but it's the best I have. Three machine conversion factories, so hopefully I can get a 10 there. I do own a raised body heat you see in the background. You're doing a fall wind as well, and that's a hard one to find. So, okay. All right, we're getting down to uh, some of the rares here shortly. Skull Redbird, Sandstone, 
Drooling Lizard, finishing it up with Succubus Knight. So then we do get into some rares. But I'm missing quite a few of the rares too. So we have two pronged attack, Grave Digger Goal, Carbonal Warrior times three, Reap of the Cards, Spirit of the Harp, Dragoness, Stop Defense I do own, and I do own Goblin Secret Remedy, Firewolf, Hain Hain I own, and then the lone LLB Hollow that I'm sending on this slow rate is a wavy sort of revealing light. So hopefully that can do well. And then these last few cards, if you are not a Pokemon fan at all, these are all going to be Pokemon cards, except for the very last card. So if you want to see that, you can stay for the surprise. So we have four lucky stadiums, three birthday Pikachus, and then just a bunch of Sky Ridge hollows that I've went through on the channel before. So uh, just really looking forward to grading some Pokemon cards and, the, and seeing how they, uh, they grade uh, compared to Yu-Gi-Oh. Kabutops, really nice card. Some reverse hollows, reverse ho ho, base set, unlimited Charizard. Nothing. I mean, I guess some of them are kind of crazy expensive, but nothing terribly too crazy. No, uh, no Shadowless or uh, base set first edition Venusaur base set two Charizard. Some winner, um, best of five promos. Some we got fossil and uh, jungle cards, uh, really nice Shining Gyarados first edition and Shining Magikarp. And then this last pile is cards I'm sending for my buddy. So just some base set one and two and jungle stuff. And uh, some another set, but I can never. And then the last card, Vile Germs, because I skipped it in entering cards online and I was not about to go redo my whole submission just to add this to the end. So, zoom through 450 cards here in about 17 minutes and 23 seconds. So, hope you guys enjoyed and I uh, really look forward to getting these cards back. So be on the lookout for that, especially those first um, 31, I believe, are going on a 20 day, 25 day turnaround. So they'll be back hopefully in a month and a half or so. So be on the lookout for that video. Give it a thumbs up, click on the notification. I've been trying to post some more videos uh, more frequently, so uh, click on the notification so you'll know when I'm posting videos. And uh, that's pretty much all I got, so thanks for watching and have a good one.